what's up welcome back to our channel and this is the seventh video of our exciting series build your own virtual assistant and today in this video we're going to implement some basic features so that our ai will be more advanced so sit back relax and let's get started so now i'm in my working directory so here are the list of things that we're going to do today so first of all is time function so first of all let us create time function so to do that i have jet time over here and uh, let me write elif time in query if the time is in query then let me create a variable current time equals uh, jet time Dead time dot now which is a function and okay so let me to use the dead time dot now function i need to do like from dead time import dead time and then now i'll be able to use it okay so let me write dot story of time and here i want the time in the form of like whenever i ask what's the time right now then it will say current time is 11 29 a.m or p.m whatever it is so to do that first of all i need to get the hour from the time hour and i need to get the minute also minute and then i want to tell if it's a.m or p.m so to do that let me write p and then we're good to go so let me make it to speak and now let me comment this scrapper bot so that it will run more faster this also can you tell me current time current time is 11 30 a.m okay so it's working okay so now we have done the time function let me tick and now we have close and switch tab so for the close and switch tab first let me comment it out and instead of this thing let me print edge only okay it's just a random thing and here what i can do step a leaf switch tab in query then i want to print a uh, place bio to query dot hot key and to switch the tab i think ctrl comma tab is used to switch and after switching a tab i don't want my virtual assistant to speak dancer or anything okay it's also basic tag so i have not implemented a speak function in this condition so you can use speak by writing speak over here so let me write elif close tab in query then i want to uh, i want prior to go to hotkey which is close tab means control w and i think it will work so let me run so let me open some tabs because i have two tabs over here switch tab close tab Done, sir. Okay, okay, so we got some error. Like, whenever I say close tab, then the close is in the query, which is, and when the close is in the query, then our this condition is going to run. Okay, so to make it working, let me cut out this line of code and paste it over here. And now it should work properly. Let me go and open some tab. And what I can do is just click on these links. Okay, so now let me go and run this. So 
स्विच टैब स्विच टैब क्लोज टैब क्लोज ओके सो नाउ कैन सी डन सर it is working properly and let me check this to this and switch tab also and now it's time for the sleep mode so we here let me write elif sleep in query if the sleep is in query so let me set a variable call sleep mode sleep mode uh, is false and here while it is in the sleep mode whenever i say go to sleep then it will speak and after that we will set uh, sleep uh, sleep mode equals true and here what we're going to do is we're going to set another loop also okay, so what i can do is while sleep mode and we have set the sleep mode to true so while sleep mode we're going to set query equals take command dot lower it which means like whenever i say go to sleep then it is listening to me but not responding okay and whenever like if wake up if the wake up in query then what i want then uh, let me make it speak uh, i am awake now how can i help you sir and then i want to set the sleep mode value to false and i think this will work now so let me run go to sleep in okay sir i am going to sleep but you can call me anytime just say wake up and i will be there for you and now you can see it's listening to us but uh now it is recognizing and whenever i say wake up in the query uh wake up i am awake now okay How can, can I, help I help you, you sir? sir? Can you tell me current time? Current time is 11:45 a.m. See, it's working. So what I can do is I can add a print query function, like print query thing over here also. Okay. So now we have done this sleep more. Now our task is to make the code shorter and good. Okay, so let us make the code clean. Let me remove this line in this. And wait, let me close this also. And after that, let me write the slip mode. And then we have click on chat button. Then we have while true. Let me remove this extra thing over here. And after that elif 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 and let me to like that let me remove this and okay so now we have make or we have completed all the tasks for this video and in the next video we're going to do something amazing so yeah that must be this today's video and i'll catch you in the next video till then take care Bye-bye.